Okay, hello folks, this is totally random generated. Uh, I'm playing a lovely little game uh, with Crimson the Wolf. Do you want to say hi? Hello. Now, I've never really played this. I've played a little bit of it and I sucked and I think Crimson is in the same boat as me. I played it once before. We're gonna get raped. <laughs> but we're gonna try and have fun doing it. So let's launch ahead. Uh, it's on easy mode. Uh, we all start with two and a half million credits, uh, one planet, one technology, and there are two other teams out in the universe. So let's let's hope we have fun, eh, Crimson? Oh yeah, I definitely hope we have fun. And you are pretty far away from me if you're the green one. Yeah, I think it's because we can see each other. I think that's it. Oh, Waldo units. What's a Waldo unit? A uh, Waldo unit lets you terraform better and not threaten lives, I believe. No, it actually reduces the cost of all ships by 10% and a 15% increase in industrial output of all units. <laughs> Wally. Oh, you have that. Wally. I don't know which tech I got. Uh, oh, no, no. I have I got, let's see, FTL communications, gauss drivers. I, I don't actually know what technology I got. Uh, I have no idea. All I know is I'm going for shield straight off. I think. Oh, I, I got. I got a gene modification. I think. Oh. I think I don't know nice. which one I got. Oh, it sucks. I have no idea. Uh, I have no idea what technology to go for. <laughs> I went for shields. Just, um, I, mean, I, have, I have access to them this time. There's no way I'm not going for them. I got screwed up by too many missiles last time not to get not to get something to deflect them away. I'm actually I'm gonna go for Waldo units. Uh, I believe they give you a hammerhead too. Is what I think. They give me a hammerhead? I have a ship. I I don't I, no I don't have a ship. I have no ships. <laughs> Uh, can I build anything? I can build a colonizer. Build a colonizer and a tanker. Yep, um... Oh jeez, my ships look freaking weird. I, I, I'm purple. All your ships are purple. At least you've got four planets in range. I mean, you've even got a little corner planet, Kavala. Which is uh, just to the south side of the, your side of the universe. So you've got a nice little planet on the script of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm going to kind of go with that half of them, if not all four of them, are going to be uncolonizable. And I'm going to go fuck. Have you ended your turn? Uh, nope. I'm going to build some stuff. Nope. Oh, cancel. So I'm going to go with Waldo units because I want the 15% industrial output bonus. What's that one? Hmm, fair enough. I can research the plague. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Lots of ships must be built. Wow, okay. Uh, I'll get cybernetic interface next, because that gives me another 20% bonus to industrial output. <laughs> Yay! I've got ships. Can you move? Yes! I can send my people and go! Yeah, I'm sending my extended range person all the way out to my very corner star. Well, I'm I've got a tanker and a colonizer. I don't I don't even have a scout. Can I build scouts? Nope, I can't build scouts. I don't have a scout ship. <laughs> so uh, I, I I think the armor is a light uh, armor is a light ship. So that's pretty much your your extended range your scout ship. Oh right, okay. Well, I'm going to build another tanker and colonizer, and another tanker and another colonizer. And I'm going to try and colonize three planets right at the start. I'm building lots of defense and attack. Very good for you. No. I I don't have any of that yet. Okay, you can go over here. Uh, okay. I'm pretty much on the thought that the Gauss cannons suck. Um, I quite like the missiles. 
You I don't have to get right up on front, right in on someone to use them. All right. I think the lasers are just point defense, really. Point defense is actually really good in this game, isn't it? I managed to get green lasers before my home planet got took over. We have made a breakthrough, Commander. Oh, apparently we've made a breakthrough. Can ah, I? Ah, that is very good. I can't colonize that planet. So, just move on to another planet, because that's got a climate hazard of unlivable. <laughs> climate hazard of 982. I don't think I'll be surviving on that planet. Uh, da -da -da. Well, maybe. Okay, I got Waldo units. Let's see. Where's Waldo? I can build an orbital foundry, which will take a long time. Seven turns. Nah, I don't want that yet. I'll research this. Uh, figure yes. out how to separate ships properly. Uh, you I can, can manage fleets. fleets. Manage fleets does that. <laughs> ah, that was so much easier. I've got a universe called Midway, so this will be interesting to go to. Uh, can I move? Oh, yeah, that'll move be there. Your d uh, that, that might be a little problematic for you in the future then. What will be a bit problematic for me? Well, if if that goes for anything in what the history of actual Midway went. Oh god, yeah. And I've also got Hitomi. <laughs> I don't remember what Hitomi is in actual history. I, I was going to say, uh, I thought it was Hiroshima for a second. Oh, there's Beetlejuice. And Gaia. And Copernicus. You got Beetlejuice? Yeah. There's Gaia. Where's, where's Beetlejuice? Uh, Beetlejuice. 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 <laughs> I see you. I got right. It's next to Rigel. Cool. And try try their conus. All right. Okay. How much I bet the Beetlejuice is the home world of some somebody. Well, that would suck because that's really close to me. Okay, come on. <laughs> Another planet which is pretty much uninhabitable by me. Uh, yeah, that, that's my prediction for all four of the worlds around me. Okay, it'll take me 47 turns to move my ships to the next area. <sighs> uh, extended range can get there fast and put a tanker with the fleet. shouldn't take that long. Okay, go to Midway. It's just it's like the two nearest planets to me are uncolonizable for the moment. Fantastic. Fan-fucking-tastic. Pretty much, pretty much. 12% complete. So I'm trying to research to get my industrial output done, so I can. Can I colonize this one? Um, I can. About done. I'll colonize with both. Yay! I've got a quick. colony. I'll have a colony next turn. Yay! Yay! Now hopefully the planet I've sent my colony ship and uh, whatever it was to. I hope that's livable, and hopefully there is no mining platform on it that will utterly destroy me. Excuse me. Forward and forever. Fa la 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 la. Tra la la la. Why have I got an update? What happened? Oh yeah, colony. Yay! I've got a colony. Da! I can't do anything with it right now. Kialdo, you red planet, you're even my color and I can't colonize you. Darn you. I'll colonize this planet as well. Fantastic. I have two planets I have colonized. Yay! Yay for you. I'm sending long range people and building defensive ships even though they're going to be completely and utterly crap. So. <laughs> right, okay. Manage mm -hmm. fleets. I haven't even Split put ships. point defense lasers on them. You... Oh, no! Damn it! Split ships. Okay. And... It's all so beautiful. You can move here. <laughs> it's like staring at a Christmas tree. <laughs> there we go. What's that happened? Fair enough.
how are you doing over there? Have you got any planets? Because I've got Midway! I have one that I can colonize. Yay, but it's the one in the farthest corner. Actually, I have two colonies. So most of most of my money is being spent on maintaining that. I'll balance out my budget a bit more. There we go. Three Not turns to complete. Extended range. I'm gonna send you back home. If people are wondering, uh, what happens in this game is you also have interest that you gain on your savings. As you can see, it's about one percent of your in of your money that you've got saved you will earn as bonus income next turn so by having money in your bank you make money so that's why I've not put everything into research because I actually want to make a bit of money on the plus side since I've just put it 50 50 I do make a heck of a lot more quicker research gotta look at my research I have my deflectors are at 139 defense stop being sucky researchers stop overusing my budget 130%, Jesus. No, really 140%. They they like to steal my money, I've realized this. It's, it's all, a, it's all a, a big conspiracy scam against you. It is, they were doing it to me last game, those stupid scientists. They just want the extra money. Don't they know I'll pay them even more to research different stuff? Can we trade technologies with one another? If we can, I, next two turns I should have deflector. Uh, I think I'll I'll see if I can trade uh, technology with you. We may have to have a connection though. Uh oh. Ah, Omega Fleet. Uh, peace. Shit. There's silicoids. Fantastic. Who's? What did that say? Broke out. Uh, broke I broke out of their shell. I got a fight and with some of the NPCs. <laughs> uh, oops. Oh. Did you die or did you win? Uh, it was a tanker versus NBCs. I lost. Right, okay, how do I open up Our the? Tanker. How do I open up the trade menu? Let's see. Uh, ho uh, hopefully, I can colonize these planets. That's my no. Hope. Don't want to surrender. Uh. I need to figure out how to make bigger ships than just destroyers. Oh, apparently, okay, that's how you compose it, but how do I trade with you? Well, maybe we need to set up a network. Uh, compose alliance. Where's compose? Uh, alliance, attack, defend. It's in the upper corner in the message screen. I can share my alliance with you. Oh, ho, ho. I request research. That's all very good of you. The swarm infestation at Hitomi remains. Mm, I don't think it did. Maybe uh, maybe we just can connect our empires, so if I send some ships out to Opiuchi... Is the Seekers wolf creatures? And uh, I see Stalin down there. Possibly. Well, sorry about that, it seems uh, our my previous recording, my game decided to just quit out apparently, so we're re-hosting. Uh, I, I think it was turn 9 I loaded up. But if not, we've lost. Ah, it's, we've lost a turn. I'm afraid we've lost a turn. Well, well, well. Oh well. Uh. I'm... All right. Okay. I'm sending out my ships so we can start bordering. Uh, if you can send some ships to Kamitara, which is the closest planet you've got to me. Uh, uh I'll send. I'll build a new. Uh... Long range and send it to Kamitara. It's just so we can uh, get a network between us so we can start, I don't know, maybe trading, I think? Hopefully. I, I just want to establish Hopefully. a network between us so we're actually attached. I can do things and do them well and not go herpa derpa and die and die miserably. Durka Durka? A freaking Durka. Okay, okay, ending turn.
Okay, let's build. Actually, what do I have built? Did I build anything? No, apparently I didn't on that turn. Uh, extended range. Why do I need a colonizer? Cool. Oh, I know I need a colonizer. You need a colonizer. I said, <laughs> uh, I said, oh yeah, I remember why I need a colonizer now. <laughs> I'm hoping that my planets will be able to set establish themselves decently. Um, I have five defense. Five defenses on my planet. That's not enough. Oh no, 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 no. I want to move this. Damn it. <laughs> uh, auto resolve it. Yeah, I lost the fleet. Sigh. I thought I could have maybe have retreated my fleet back and save it, but nope, I lost it. Yes, I've completed flectors. Nice. Uh, I'm still researching something. I'll figure out. How to, hopefully, we'll figure out how to trade with resources with one another. Let me give me a second. I'm gonna I'm gonna Google it. Let's see. Sword of the Stars technology trading. Google is always fun. Aha! Diplomacy. There we go. So eventually it'll be bring it off top and hopefully we'll be able to figure out how to trade technologies and become super! This website doesn't exist anymore. Fantastic. <laughs> uh... G uh, apparently I got gene modification right off too. Maybe that's a starting tech. Maybe that's that just that one free tech is what that is. Uh, no, nah, I can't figure out. Maybe someone can comment below how we can trade technologies, but they'll probably just be like watching and just thinking, "Oh my god!" But I've never played this game before. I just have some basic knowledge of like civilization and sins of a solar empire. I've I have. No idea on anything. I just know I need to. Oh, huh. more shield stuff. What do these do? I've got an asteroid belt. Mm. Ooh, shields mark one seem interesting. Let's see what destructor shield, disruptor shields do. Build another couple of colonizers. Shipyards, getting up. Shipyards, nice, getting I need up. weapons. I need weapons. I now. I still have no weapons Torpedo. whatsoever. I, I don't even have any armor ships. I'm just sort of sending out colonizers to do all my work. Oh yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm 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 developing uh, my torpedo ships now. Nice. You have you have Save more. Tail. You have more military tech than me. I have. I'm just sending out people to do my bidding for me. <laughs> oh yeah, are you sending any ships out to uh, Camtara yet? I'm trying to find Camtara now. There it okay, is. Okay, yeah. Six turns until my extended range gets there. Wow. Okay, fair enough. I just I just want to know if Camtara is a safe planet, and then... Yay, system update. Okay, planets have made it. Sweet. Oh, I can colonize that world. And that um, world. Sweet. Colonize. Okay, advanced robotics. I don't care how much it costs me. Colonize the freaking world. Oh, six more turns. Oh, that's just that's just too good to dis. Oh, Key Caldo, tis 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 Key Caldo. As soon as you get over here, I'll give you um, I'll give you the disruptor shields I've developed. Uh, hopefully, um, I'm just trying to figure out what technology to research now. Node focusing. Hmm. Mines. It lets you travel faster, I'm assuming. Yeah. But I'm already traveling quite fast anyway, so I don't need to worry about that just yet. I think I need to get a technology. What should I get? Uh, ballistic weapons, missiles, or energy weapons? I'm going to go on the energy weapon tree just because. So I'll go down the Goss or the ballistic weapons. That, that would kind of fit. Humans stick to ballistic, aliens stick to their pew pew lasers. Okay, so we'll be search mass drivers. I've only got red lasers right now. Oh my god. Right. They suck. And ending my turn. 
Hey. Two colonized planets. Nice. You've... And one soon to be a, co and one soon to be colonized. Alpha Fleet Two. Do remember, Move it costs out. a hell of a lot of money to upgrade your planets. I'm willing to spend it. I'll just focus all my construction. Construction. I have a really, really nice yeah. planet here. It's only got a 76 climate hazard. Oh, you son of a git! <laughs> Both of my colonized planets have like almost five times that. The five two times. other ones I got. Kavala has got 170. Whenever I get it, can get a ship over to colonize it, and Key Doral Allo's got 400. Do you want? Dol Ara has do you want to know the? Okay, I've got two rocks near my planet. Basically, I have two Mercuries with a climate hazard of nearly a thousand. I have a Kel Caldo, a red planet. That's 714 climate hazard. <sighs> it still means that e he... you'll be able to colonize your planets a hell of a lot sooner than I will. So you're at a severe advantage to mine. Well, we're allies, right? We're allies permanently, so. Yeah, hopefully. Uh, that's not going to be a problem. <laughs> right, okay, and... I've almost got ballistic weapons. Uh, Chief Leet is just a tanker. Or Chief Leet. Ch-ch-ch-chia. ch 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 changes <laughs> The political map. Galactic axes. Centers. I would send out light defenses. Yeah, I should start building them, but I don't have the the finances to be able to do that. I I I don't really know. Like I I I'm I a third of all of my money is spent on trying to improve my two planets. <laughs> uh, I've got about four million bucks. So if I got almost five million, I really should put more into research. I don't even know how to make it to where I can put more stuff into stuff. Oh, you can, you've can. you got a little slider. See, just below your pie chart. Oh, it wouldn't let me mess with those before. Yay. You've got a little... Terraforming first. Tiny little... Oh, you're on the planets. Yeah, you can shift it around. Don't over-harvest. Seriously, don't. Just keep it at I the bottom. I will never over-harvest. I mean, <laughs> what reason is there to besides to make the planet useless? Yeah, uh, I think it just speeds up, but I think that's just a negative impact to do. Um... Hey, my my extended range that's going back home has met my fleet that's going out to colonize the planet it, it, cool. it found. Let's see if my ships are going to be smacking into combat. I've got Basically, I've got two ships full of people going to a planet that's un un unscouted. I, this, is, this can only go well. <laughs> I've already done that with two of my planets. I the the one planet it didn't go well. A tanker just sacrificed himself for greater glory. For the glory of the empire. Yes, my liege. Who's my population in these planets? I have a hundred and forty-six people and six hundred and nineteen people in these planets. No wonder they're struggling. <laughs> I have a hundred and thirty-four and forty-one on my two. So you've got an entire planet with just 41 people. <laughs> yeah, that's the one that's more deadly than the other one. Oh my Terraform the crap out God! Of the climate hazard on that planet is 903! What? On Kel Can Do you terraform it? On Ket Dolara, you've got a colony on a climate hazard planet of 903. <laughs> no, I don't. I got one. Holara? Dolara? D O L A R R A? Yeah. Candelara. Four hundred and sixteen for me. Oh my god! That maybe uh, it must be like you different climate hazards for different races then. Yeah, check out Cole Hoth Hothra and see how big the climate hazard is for you. Four hundred and ten. It's seventy six for me. Okay, can you have a look at a couple of my planets and see what the climate hazard is for you then? Because eight hundred forty five on and one hundred and eighty three on Midway. God damn it! You're a hell of a lot more resistant than my people. I don't like this. <laughs> Hacks. <laughs> I, 
I chose the lizard people. Ah, uh, you must like hotter planets. So obviously a colder planet, you guys don't survive as well. Apparently. Well, no, I've got more people on the one that's got on the 73 on mine. On the 183 there, it's showing red, so I don't know what the crap is going on there, if that would be deadly for me or not. Well, I think, anyway, let's continue on. And hope to all godly hell that my colony ships survive, and this is a colonizable planet. Hopefully. Oh hey, it actually researched properly. Nope, that's not colonizable. I have disruptor torpedo. You have disruptor torpedoes. Congratulations. I can get eight spend eighteen turns getting the better tor torpedoes, but I need tech. Do I wanna go plasma or laser out? Mm, that's up to you. I I just improved the industrial output of my planets because I feel that's probably a very Oh it's a medium mount. I'll definitely take that, and the green lasers. Ooh, special mount. Okay, I can see why I was failing. I was only going on the laser path last time. Ah, so nice. Well, in turn. Okay, okay. In turn. Uh. Ah. Oh! Did, <laughs> did you get to this planet here? <sighs> I got to. Uh, I got to Opuchi, so you're still to get to Camtara. And yeah, that, that's completely deadly for me, I think, is it's flashing red. Really? Yeah, yeah, the climate hazard is flashing red and showing 1364 for me. Oh, it's only 877 for me. Yay! I guess different planets do different things. Oh, it's on the other side of the spectrum. Notice, because uh, some of your planets for me are on the left side. Uh, Opiechi is on the far right side, so obviously it's a very cold planet. Oh, yeah, 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 because I can't colonize Kel Caldo. It's got 714, it's on the far right. Da, 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 da. Far left, and the middle. I think more towards the middle is more ideal for my people. Right, could have built expert systems. 15% in bonus to industrial output. And I'm going to design a ship. A combat ship. Oh, hey, I forgot about I need to do that, but I want green lasers before I do that. <laughs> what? I, I have drones! Seriously? Uh, awesome. Apparently so. I, oh, I think you uh, got that whenever you went down a certain path. Oh, cool. Okay, I'll save that as. Drone Shuttle 1. There is lava on a Fuchi. Oh, Fuchi, or whatever. There's lava on it, and it's on a cold planet. I can see there's lava on it. I'm zoomed in right on it. Oh, well. Okay, I'm going to build ten of these shuttles, and I'm going to send them to attack uh, one of the flashing red planets. Yeah, Copricornus or Hitomi. The big X planets. Yes. The planets that are noticeably dangerous, I'm going to send ships at. <laughs> um, oh, Camtara. Size 5, Imperial 100. God damn it. Did you colonize Camtara? No, 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 no. Wait, Camtara, Camtara, Camtara. No, no. I've not colonized Camtara. What the fuck? That's, that's yours. You own Camtara. Uh... I didn't realize I. I'm, how the I hell? I don't know if I own that. How how did you get that? What? I have no idea. That's I'm a fully like, colonized world. What? Um, I have no idea. Uh, check your news at the bottom, like the sliding bar. That out. Camtara surrenders. 
<laughs> how much in what? how much income do you get from that? I have no idea. I just know it says surrender. Click on it. Click on it, it'll tell you you get an income of from this planet. Oh, 30,000. 30, you bastard! <laughs> you son I of a... I showed up there. Yeah. Oh, who lives here? Oh god, we surrender to you. Wait, what? <laughs> it's like, you basically you arrived in this little scout ship, and this guy came out and just said, Hi! And they all just sort of went, We praise you, God! <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> and your and your lizard guy's like at the flame going, I don't I Oh, okay. It's like he's basically like, I don't have a gun. Wait, no, that's bad. <laughs> Praise me people <laughs> Oh wait, I, he does have guns on it, but <laughs> you gotta have some way to shoot those asteroids away from you, but <laughs> But really, I got a free world. <laughs> you should have tried to go there first. Oh my god. Oh no. Did I leave the game? Did you? I have no idea. Where did my Sword of the Stars go? Did, oh, <laughs> did the game close for you? It did done the same thing, so I, I think my recording. Yeah, my recording stopped. They can hear me talking on yours, but I, they can't hear me yeah. on mine. I'm trying to figure out, uh, it should have auto-saved, but I'm trying to remember how to quit out of the game now. Oh, you oh. don't have to leave the game. I can just get back into it and join at the point I did. Really? I oh, okay. Tab the game out. It, it, it shouldn't be anything different than that. I wasn't the host, so... Well, okay, so you should just be able to find me in the lobby and join, I hope. Yep. Well, in the meantime, I'll just manage a few things then. <laughs> Don't end your turn! No, no, I don't plan on ending my turn. Although I get the feeling the AI would do better than us, and I'm being honest and quite fair. Yep, there you are, you're back I in. I know. You gotta load. Let me change my shift colors, curse you! <laughs> and end the turn. No, oh, no, no. That's not wait end till turn I'm yet. going back into the game. Oh, you're back in yet? Because it said you said I'm waiting till I go back in before I do, before I s recording again. Ah, fair enough. I'm still recording, so it's recording all of your mess. I I still think you're a bam for suddenly just magically getting a planet. <laughs> that is unfair. <laughs> <laughs> Blame the game, not me. You're like, oh, let's, let's go to this world. Uh, you go to that world first. And you get a planet for it. You should be praising me. I told you to go there. <laughs> you could have got that planet, but you you were like, oh, hey, I don't want to go to this planet and get killed. You go there first. And it rewarded you for your brave efforts. Ah. Uh. I think the game might be a little biased to humans. In the negative fashion? Yeah. Apparently I could colonize Upaluchi, but it's got a climate hazard of 877. I'd be terraforming that planet for years. I'm kind of focusing all my efforts on industrial output for my planets. So eventually I get my infrastructure up to such a decent level that it's all wonderful. Next playthrough we're going through, I'm going to be the Seekers or whoever, or whatever their actual name is in the races. Darn it game, are you being so slow? What's being so slow? For you to join the game? Oh yeah, it's not letting me in the game. Really? Yet. What do you mean by yet? Still loading. Roading! We are roading. Please wait. You'll be roading the game! Roading! I have a feeling that my AI may screw me over. 
<laughs> Do you want me to skip over a turn and then see what happens to you? You can. Okay, let's let's go on a turn. Let's go turn forward and see what happens. Please waiting while game synchronizes. So I actually just screwed myself, so I can't do anything now. <laughs> oh yeah, that that's me coming into the game now. Oh, so it did need me to end the turn. Oh, cool. Huh. Fair enough, so you just like missed the turn, which I'm hoping was sorted out by the game. Let's see, my new planet. My home world. Let's see how my new planet, my fully colonized free planet is doing. It doesn't like and it's only got a morale of 51. Oh my Jesus, it's almost got a billion citizens. Th congratulations to you, I still have... Well, apparently I've got about 3 billion. Be more of a... A curse than a blessing. What makes you say that? Uh, well, I say that, that because I've got a morale of 51 and there's a nearly a billion civilians and there's only about 600 Imperial Imperial my people there. Well, on the plus side, on one of your other planets you have 94 people. <laughs> uh, da -da 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 -da. Let's see, Kohatha. How many people do you got? Oh my Enter. geez, they've got about 6,000 people now. How much sex have they been having? Well, you are lizard people. I'm going to assume that you lay eggs. But like two turns ago, it was 130. You laid a lot of eggs. <laughs> Apparently. So let me guess. You're sh you're, not only are you able to convince people to turn into your forces, but you're also able to magically conjure people out of nowhere. I have no idea. I have no freaking idea. I just know this is hilarious. And I'm colonizing Kavala. Check this. Oh, I can't colonize Q Pack. You might be able to. Maybe. Okay, ending of turn. You, sir, are an idiot. Okay, third time's a charm. That's me back again in recording. <laughs> uh, I'm going to have to split this in chunks so it's, it renders each part as uh, a video. So it'll be a bit humorous to watch the, each section. But I need to be, basically you need to be very careful where you click in this. You recording again yet? Oh yeah, I'm recording. Apparently I'm the number one player. I don't know why, but apparently I am. Apparently I'm number three. Because it's like... I have no idea why. And the the Seekers, the Wolfmen, are number six. Wolfmen, how dare you be so sucky. Okay, and back in the game. Where I need to basically keep my mouse in the middle of the game. <laughs> middle of the window, so hopefully I don't misclick anywhere. Wee, wee, wee. I've got about five million bucks. I have five point two because I I just want to constantly save up money. Oh, that's how you're doing. That's how you're number one. It's just money. Apparently, nobody else has five million dollars. Oh, I said to everyone should start it off with two and a half, so they must be spending it at a rate of knots. And my cat is saying hello to my legs. Hello. That means wolf must be really imperialistic. Yeah, no money whatsoever. <laughs> <laughs> Got big fleets that are going out trying to conquer. Apologies if Crimson sometimes breaks up for the recording. Uh, not much we can do about that. It's just um, internet. He is across the big pond from me. We. Okay, right. I'm gonna end my turn. You're. You seem to be coming in loud and clear though. It's not. It's every so often it'll just warble garble, but it's you know it's maybe like a couple of seconds every ten minutes, you know. It's nothing much. Ah. It's just, it's basically, it's the lag catching up with itself. It just compounds to such a part, and then it just, you know, catches up and it it. does that warble garble. Yay! I saved the turn! And damn it. You left the game? 
I, I was trying to fix it. I couldn't see the intern button, and I was trying to drag it up. <laughs> oh, you're silly. Well, at least the game's still hosting, so, you know. That means it ended that recording. <laughs> DF racks. I'm gonna have fun throwing all these together. And I And I'm not gonna have as big of a problem as editing as you. Uh it's not much because uh if it stops recording, thankfully Fraps just ends it and it'll save that part, so it's actually really good to edit. Oh jeez, and at one turn I went down to fourth place. Really? Jesus. Instead of being third. Am I still first? Yep. Hoorah. Oh, the rebellion and the bird people are tied for third. Aww. So cute. My kitty's you trying to jump up. Third. Up you come then. In my, I got. Up you I come. Like that's what I got. Okay. So my cat's again, as I said, trying to jump up. So let's see. Should I research green lasers or continue to focus? Well, you can, but that's the tech tree I'm going to focus on in military. Okay, so we'll trade lasers and stuff like that, and I'll trade atmosphere things. Yep. Um, I'm going to actually improve my atmospheric stuff, so I'm going to improve my terraforming capability. Okay, right. I'm I'm recording straight up again, and I know I'm saying I'm recording. I'm recording every time this cuts out, so you're gonna suddenly get me saying I'm recording. But it's purely for Crimson's benefit to know when it's happening. He does the vice versa for me. What happens yep. is whenever you click on the outside window of this game, it'll crash, and we have to play this on full screen mode, or else we're gonna accidentally done it, like the three times I've personally done it, and Crimson's done it a couple of times himself. So. I think I'm going to have this up as a sort of fail compendium. Uh, me and Crimson are going to practice and play around a bit, but I'm not going to record it because this is going to have a, f a few mess ups. So we're just going to try and learn the game. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this little fuck up from me mainly. <laughs> so Crimson, do you want to say anything to this? We're going to get raped off screen. Sound, sounds about right. Yeah, I would, I would agree with that one. So uh, have fun folks and I hope you enjoy this short teaser and there will be a series uploaded. Me and, Gr me and Crimson will record a series and we will upload it for your benefit, don't worry. This is just sort of the, the trailer I would assume. So have fun folks and peace and out. we actually have a proper recording, we'll throw this up and we might actually do it on normal difficulty. Yeah, maybe, maybe. As if we're actually decent at this game, which we I, I don't think we were going to be. So have fun folks and peace out.